It is an anniversary one Southern Kentucky family says they wish they didn't have to commemorate. Yesterday marked one year since Jerry Thompson died in a crash in Laurel County. Investigators say he was driving when another car hit his head on. The driver, Justin Wibbles, is charged with murder, reckless driving, and wanton endangerment. But despite the charges, he's out of jail. And as WKYT's Phil Pendleton tells us, Thompson's family wants justice. And a top story at 5:30. Anniversaries are days families like to spend celebrating. But for this family, June 16th, 2014, is no such day. Ever since he's been gone a year, yesterday, it's just. We're living in a nightmare still yet. There's no justice been done. They mark the one year since the husband and father died by putting up this large wooden cross. You can still see debris from that awful day. Everything I've lost my world. While his children say they will never get over their broken hearts. Anything I needed done, I couldn't do. Dad could always do it. Justin D. Wibbles was indicted three months after the crash. He was charged with murder, reckless driving, and wanton endangerment. Police say he was speeding and drove in the emergency lane to pass a car where his truck and Thompson's windstream van collided head on. A lady stopped in front of my dad, so he swerved into his emergency lane to miss hitting a lady. Wibbles was arrested but released on bond. Court records show that he's since been charged with assault from an incident with the victim's relatives at a court hearing. We're very angry, you know. We're, we're still hurt by the fact that he's not here with us no more. And, but now I'm in a position where I'm very angry. Wibbles is due back in court on June 22nd in Laurel County, Phil Pendleton, WKYT. Relatives say they've been told Wibbles will face a trial sometime this fall, but a date has not been set.